Templars desire to understand the nature of these artifacts. Their spies have called upon many doctors and other learned people in New York. They have also approached many tribes with questions. Yeah, they've been showing that manuscript far and wide. No one can read the strange writing or understand the images. We do have a name, though. We learned that Lawrence Washington sent out the manuscript. Lawrence Washington. Businessman, Virginian politician, and high-ranking Templar. Why, uh, yes. I recently heard he was back from the West Indies. One of my men saw his major domo pick up a strange package. Then that package will be delivered to him promptly. Shay, figure out what it is and find Washington. And when you do, learn all you can. I'll prepare the Morrigan. Yeah. Please come in and cast an eye about. My gratitude. Godspeed. Captain has the helm! Get the man! Well, if we've any luck, that ship will lead us right to him. I make my own luck, Liam. And Washington is running out of his. Aye. There she is! All right, man. Time to be quiet. The wind. Lawrence Washington is a powerful businessman, a slave owner, and a leading Templar. We lost track of him about a year ago. I recently learned he was in Barbados, but I haven't been able to confirm that. Now. Now you think he had something to do with the theft of the artifacts, don't you? I wouldn't put it past him. Haiti's a short voyage from Barbados, and his return to the colony certainly coincides with the arrival of the artifacts. We cannot let the Templars get control of these colonies. Whatever happens, Lawrence Washington must not survive. I'll make sure he doesn't. Topsails and gallants! Studs up! Heave! Heave! Captain! We have trouble! Loose and trip too! That cliff will break Loose. us! Haul in the studs! There she is! All right, man. All Time to be quiet. Lawrence Washington is a powerful businessman, a slave owner, and a leading Templar. We lost track of him about a year ago. I recently learned he was in Barbados, but I haven't been able to confirm that. Now. Now you think he had something to do with the theft of the artifacts, don't you? I wouldn't put it past him. Haiti's a short voyage from Barbados. And his return to the colony certainly coincides with the arrival of the artifacts. We cannot let the Templars get control of these colonies. Whatever happens, Lawrence Washington must not survive. I'll make sure he doesn't. Give me some speed! 
Main captain! It's a gunboat! Floating cog! A blockade, Captain! Right, this won't do. Shay, you must follow that ship on land. I'll do that. Bring the Morrigan around another way. Aye, Captain. Track that package and find Where's Washington. The Royals? Draw a banker. Sub blockade. And remember what I said, Shay. Washington must die. Stop there. It seems to me there's more clashes between England and France. Yeah. Shake. Guards! Mm -hmm. Damn it. Whip. You there! <laughs> oh. ah! What's this? A rifle? You there! Stay! Where are you? How can that be? It makes no sound. Thanks for the present, Master Washington. This is a strange surprise. Not quite what I was expecting. Now I must find Washington and interrogate him.
Need to get to Washington first. Then I'll worry about the artifacts. Are you sure you shouldn't be in bed? I am fine, George. Be a good host for my sake. Go to the wine cellar and get something special for our guests. I will. Gentlemen? <coughs> my brother is a bright spot in a troubled land. If I may make one request before I depart this life, please leave him in peace. He should have nothing to do with the troubles of the Templar cause. We all respect that sentiment, sir. You have my thanks, gentlemen. Master Smith, are you ready to leave on your voyage? Aye, sir. I shall return with answers. Master Wardrop, are you likewise engaged with the manuscript? Yes, sir. We will soon know its meaning. Then I bid you take your leave. <laughs> Washington can barely stand on his own two feet. Better be right about him, Liam. Because I'm about to murder a dying man. Stop! Never too late to ruin Templar plans, Master Washington. <coughs> but my plans are already in motion. Even leading you here <coughs> has given my allies time to escape. <coughs> Thank you for 
making my end a quick one. <sighs> and thank you for revealing your master plan, you scheming snake. Damn it. I'd better hurry. Liam, I hope we brought the ship around. Got a pressing engagement! Uh. We won't get past. Is that a ship, Mortar? That's not sporting! Lawrence Washington is dead. You look disappointed. The sickly way that man looked, he would have been dead in a month anyway. And two other Templars got away. They're looking into the manuscript and box. Did they have the artifacts? I don't know. Perhaps. I can't be sure. Then you did what was right by the Brotherhood. You'll find the object later. Cheer up, Shay. It's a rare day we can sow such chaos among the Templars. Perhaps. But to hear Washington speak, it didn't sound like they'd be too put out by the loss. Well, that's what he'd want you to think. Chevalier, what happened to your vessel? I got myself into a bit of a scrape. Sent three ship in all hand to their watery grave. The Giafu nearly followed them down. Just your fate has been better, Le Chasseur. Indeed. My sources inform me that Samuel Smith has searched far and wide, looking for answers on how to make that strange box work. He just returned from Europe. Where is he now? Refitting his schooner. If you hurry. You can catch him... there. Oh, remember those blueprints? Well, I had an engineer build that marvelous weapon for your ship. Master Pucker's gun fires more shots than an artillery brigade, and twice as fast. Many thanks. Anything for my hooded friends. Captain? I will join you on this voyage. Then shall we, gentlemen? You are in a jovial mood, Shay. Why shouldn't I be? I have a new weapon, and will soon have a chance to use it. Besides, Templars are usually well guarded, and I'm sure that Smith fellow is no exception. I also took the liberty of ordering some improvements. Morgan now has a ram cut through ice itself. There he is! Most fortunate timing! Lady Luck never ceases to smile on you! He's seen us! Give chase! Hold your fire! We must not damage the box or risk losing it to the sea! Can't this bucket go any faster? At least my ship is still seaworthy, Chevalier! Fire! Our target is smart, man. Samuel Smith is the Templar's treasurer! 
What he's doing in these waters is beyond me. Maybe he came here to meet someone. Or ran into your pirates. He's refitting his ship. Something must have happened. If one of my allies attacked him, I would have known about it. Well, he's back from a long voyage. Now's our chance to get him. Smith controls most of the Templars well, doesn't he? With him out of the way... Washington entrusted the precursor box to him. He probably still has it. Shay's right. The box comes first. So we can't sink him. We'll have to board his ship or force him to beach. Look, Captain. He's cutting through the ice. It seems you're not the only one equipped with such a ram, Shay. Let us hope ours fares just as well. It worked. The way is clear. Now, once more, your fortune holds. But do not waste time congratulating yourself. Smith is getting away. Careful, Shay. These waters are... It's an ambush! Halfway you sit, you have not Smith must not escape! I don't see Smith's ship. Let's get rid of these distractions first. We'll find him. Disappoint him, and he's still within reach. Careful, it's quite Holy a rough spot. What wickedness is this? Another Templar tactic. They can cover whole stretches of ocean with their flames. Careful, Shay. We could be burnt to cinders. It's nothing more than a last desperate throw of the dice. He knows we have him. I'm going to fast. Oh, this endless ice is peaceful, isn't it? Wind's getting vicious. Now we know where he was headed. Barson has an encampment here. Follow him on land. Do not even think of firing the ship's weapons near that precious box. I'll take care of this. Thank <laughs> you. 
artifact treasure from those who came before yes it matters not <coughs> some of the greatest scientific minds of all Europe could not make it work <coughs> now all I need is the manuscript and all shall be revealed In Albany, sir. Just visiting. My here. Congress is still in session. George Washington and his militia have fired on French troops under Jumonville. The French are calling it an act of war. George Washington. You mean Lawrence's younger brother? Yeah, it's the same. Speaking of Lawrence Washington, 
But you eliminated him. James Wardrop has moved up in ranks. All the Templar resources are at his disposal now. What about the manuscript? My sources in New York confirm that Wardrop has it. I also learned that he is here at the Congress under heavy guard. Shay, find Wardrop. Get that manuscript. This place is thick with Templar troops. Liam and I will make sure he doesn't escape. must be the Templar William Johnson. Perhaps he has the manuscript, or knows where it is. As I have stated previously, I believe we need a national union, granted by an act of parliament, but bringing greater independence to our colonies. The French are an immediate threat, and we are ill prepared to face them. To put it bluntly, the colonies must join, or die. Rousing speech, Master Franklin. But do you truly believe Great Britain will grant our colonies autonomy? They have little choice, Master Johnson. You know the remoteness of this frontier better than most. Yes. But let us leave politics for another day. I wanted to thank you for your research. Of course. Of course. In the brief time I could examine that box, I could tell it was something unique. From ancient Egypt, you said? Well, as I mentioned in my letter, I am quite ready to electrify it. Excellent. We will have the box delivered shortly. As for the manuscript, Captain? I apologize, sir, but Master Wardrop refused to hand it over. He said the risks were too great. The risks? Ah. I apologize. You will have the manuscript and the box in the briefest of delays. You made the excuse for a uniform. Run to Fort Frederick and tell Master Wardrop he had better cough up the manuscript post-haste. Else I will have him scalped. I can't let that lobster captain reach Wardrop. I won't let you pass. Get back here. Yeah. Damn it. Clear shot. Now to Wardrop and the manuscript.
I'll take that, you Templar dog. No! You have no idea what you're doing, fool! Keeping the people free from your control. How free will you be when the French undermine these squabbling colonies? These colonies would be far better off without the Templars pulling the strings. <laughs> we bring order from chaos. If everything is permitted, no one is safe. Even the devil can quote scripture to suit his own purposes.